Hi, we're in Taos today, attempting to paint this landscape if the weather holds up. <laughs> the clouds are moving, um, which is a good sign, I think. But in any case, we'll try to block it in, try to get size and placement of all the um, landscape that we want to paint, and we'll make an attempt, and you can always come back tomorrow. Let's see what's going on. <laughs> and so <clears throat> the very first thing is that I look for the horizon line and I see that it's really eye level. I'm not looking above, looking down into a valley or up at a mountain. I'm looking straight on. So my horizon line will be somewhere in here. That's the first thing I wanted to establish. And it gets a little bit higher as I go back here. Okay, so I'm looking for a way to come into the painting. Go back and see these little ma this sort of mountain range all the way in the back that's getting that little bit of light on it. I think that would be something really beautiful to try and capture for just today. So this beautiful row of sage back here is sort of marking the horizon for me pretty well. And it's really interesting to see, I mean, what I'd like to try and capture here is the size of these houses compared to this enormous mountainside. So that's sort of the concept of the painting, is this size of this stuff. So, um, I, you know, you have the license to move things around <laughs> as an artist. That's your prerogative, that you're allowed to move things around as you, for the painting, for the painting's sake. So one of the concepts about plein air painting, about painting the landscape, is that the the source of light here is the sky, and so I'm looking for different value changes that the light is making on the landscape, the sky or the sun. So, <clears throat> the obviously the sky is the lightest, um, the lightest thing in the painting, and then the objects that are perpendicular or the trees are the most saturated. They get the least light, really. And the mountains, which are a 45 degree angle, are getting a little bit more light and the ground gets the most light aside from the sky.
Thank you. <laughs> that wraps up today's adventure. <laughs> I hope you had fun watching. I have fun doing it, but it's really cold. <laughs> so we'll say goodbye till tomorrow, and we'll try and taste something new. Bye.